we remain deeply concerned by the deteriorating situation in the region. Canada strongly condemns Iran's direct military strike against Israel. The current escalation of tensions is in no one's interest. We have to put an end to this escalation of violence. We, along with our G7 partners, are calling on all parties to do everything in their power to protect civilian populations, to allow humanitarian aid to urgently reach those who need it, and to respect international humanitarian law. We must find a path towards a ceasefire and the release of hostages, and Canada supports efforts by the US, Qatar, and Egypt to reach such a deal. So we, um, we have been consistent about calling for a ceasefire, calling a need to end the violence. The um, terrorist organizations, Hezbollah and Hamas, have caused uh, countless deaths, uh, but so has uh, the response of Israel. Um, we need to make sure that we see de-escalation and we need to continue to hold Iran to account for its uh, funding and organizing behind the scenes of Hamas, of, he of Hezbollah, of the Houthis. Um, we need uh, to ensure that we're strengthening sanctions and response as uh, Israel uh, is uh, legitimate in wanting to respond to Iran's recent uh, missile attacks. But at the same time, we have to be mindful about not letting this situation get further inflamed, inflamed not allowing uh, or seeing further escalation of violence or spreading of conflict to the region.